Hi, my name is Sue Charman Anderson and over the next five minutes I'm going to talk about why mentoring is important and why you should be both a mentor and a mentee. But first, mentoring can mean different things to different people. I'm using the word to mean a long-term, structured mentoring relationship where the mentee has goals and tasks and checks in with their mentor on a regular basis. Now, we have decades of research that illustrates the benefits of mentoring to both mentor and mentee. Mentees improve their soft skills, confidence and communication skills, and they develop better ways to process feedback and solve problems. They also enjoy more peer support and their career prospects are improved, for example, by receiving coaching through promotion processes. Mentoring is, of course, a two-way street. Mentors improve their leadership skills and gain new insights into their business and industry. They also benefit from improved peer recognition and experience increased job satisfaction. Yet despite all of these benefits, one study found that 63% of women have never had a mentor. So why aren't more women seeking out mentors or becoming mentors? Research shows that women have a few key worries. Firstly, they worry that their preferred mentor might say no. But actually, women are very happy to be mentors. They're just not being asked. Indeed, 71% of women always say yes to requests to be a mentor, and most women would mentor more if asked. Women also worry that they just don't have time to be an effective mentor. But only 9% of women say that mentoring actually takes time away from their own work and I'm sure they'd agree that the benefits are worth that time investment. Women are also often uncomfortable about mentoring because they think they don't have the right expertise, particularly technical and subject matter expertise. But actually, mentees are generally looking for someone to help with soft skills like negotiation, influencing and managing interpersonal relationships. We know that mentoring is critical to career success and not just in the early years of a woman's career. Indeed, one of the key times in a woman's working life is that mid-career period, 10 to 20 years in. Mentorship is as important for the mid-career woman as it is for early career women. The Kellogg School of Business says that the mid-career marathon is the time when effective mentorship and sponsorship are critical and a lack of good guidance increases the likelihood of a career exit for women. One study found that 80% of women in science, engineering and technology report loving their work, but 56% leave their organisations at the mid-level points in their career, and 41% of women in high tech quit, compared to just 17% of men. These numbers just don't add up. If 80% of women love their work, why do 56% of them quit 10 to 20 years into their careers? And why do 41% of women in high tech quit while only 17% of men quit? Research shows that women leave for really quite mundane reasons that fall into three main categories. Firstly, a lack of opportunities to grow. So a lack of training and development opportunities. Secondly, a lack of support. So that might be support from managers or a lack of support for balancing work and other responsibilities. And finally, poor career prospects, difficulty advancing into leadership roles and a lack of access to creative, innovative roles. Mentoring can help with these issues by providing women with not just practical advice and information about how to tackle specific issues and situations, but also emotional and psychological support. And the importance of mentoring to women's careers shows in the numbers. Both mentors and mentees are more likely to be promoted and to stay in their jobs. Indeed, mentorship provides a five times higher rate of promotion for mentees and a six times higher rate of promotion for mentors, as well as a 30% improvement in staff retention. And employers report that 58% of participants performed their jobs better. This is why we've started the Finding Ada Network, a new online mentorship and knowledge sharing network for women in STEM. We provide members with access to a world-class online mentorship platform alongside exclusive content covering careers advice, personal and professional development, 
plus HR policy and advocacy advice. We have decades of evidence that mentorship is beneficial to both mentors and mentees, as well as employers. So I would encourage you all to look at your mentoring opportunities, not just to find yourself a mentor, but to be a mentor as well. So please join us on the Finding Ada Network at bit.ly slash join hyphen F-A-N. We'll see you there.